Now there are various methods by which we can prepare acid and base. So let us see preparation of acids and base. Here I have differentiated the acid and base. So one by one we will take. First acid from non-metals and base from metals. Non-metal when react with oxide it gives non-metal oxide and they are acidic. Metal when react with oxides it gives metal oxide and they are basic. So acid from non-metals so our chlorine is non-metal. When it reacts with hydrogen it gives us hydrochloric acid. Here metal it reacts with oxygen and it gives us sodium oxide and they are basic in nature. The second type acid from acidic oxide. Whenever the acidic oxide is there they are from non-metal. For example carbon, sulfur and phosphorus. Carbon and oxide. Carbon's oxide, carbon dioxide, sulfur's oxide, sulfur dioxide, phosphorus oxide, phosphorus pentoxide. When they are dissolving in the water, then they are giving respective oxides. Carbon dioxide plus water, it gives us carbonic acid. Sulfur dioxide dissolving water, it gives us sulfurous acid. Phosphorus pentoxide dissolved in water and gives us phosphoric acid. So non-metal oxide when dissolved in water it gives us acid. Now what about base? It is from basic oxide. So it is from metal oxide. When metal react with oxygen it gives us metal oxide and they are basic in nature. Potassium and sodium both are metal. When they dissolve in water they gives us Potassium hydroxide and sodium hydroxide. Both are basic in nature. Third type, acid from salts. When potassium nitrate react with acid, in the presence of heat, it gives a salt and it displaced volatile acid. From where it will displace? This hydrogen it will displace. So one hydrogen will go with this and one hydrogen will remain over here. So it will be displaced volatile acid. Now base from salt. So aluminium chloride when react with alkali it gives NaCl salt and basic hydroxide because it's aluminium hydroxide, metal hydroxide and they are basic in nature. And it will precipitate out. This sign suggests us that it will precipitate out. Now acid by oxidation of non-metals. So sulfur and when it reacts with acid, it undergoes oxidation. And it gives us H2SO4, sulfuric acid, water and nitrogen dioxide. So here it is giving us acid. Now base by decomposition of salt. One salt you are breaking into a pieces that is a decomposition reaction when you are taking a one reactant and for a product you are getting two or three different compounds then it is a decomposition reaction so lead nitrate we are taking and it undergoes heat then we will get lead, di lead oxide nitrogen dioxide and oxygen so this is by decomposition of salt and this is oxidation of non-metals. These are different types of method that by which we will get acid and base.